What's up guys, it is your boy Ratchet, and this episode is gonna be the best class setup for the Honey Badger Assault Rifle. Now the Honey Badger is probably one of the best assault rifles in the game and apologies if the setup has come a bit late but I really love my Honey Badger and it's my go-to weapon when I'm struggling. So uh, we're gonna get straight into it. The Honey Badger, I like to run it since it's got an inbuilt silencer. Uh, with grip and extended clip, uh, extended clip helps a lot because in many situations where you may be uh, spraying a bit to get multiple enemies and you don't have to reload. And grip helps to reduce the recoil. The recoil on the honey badger is a bit random, meaning it goes all 360 degrees, not only up or down. It just goes up, down, sometimes left, right. But if you can control it, it is a lethal weapon, and I'm sure you guys can like me uh, because. It, it just comes with practice and experience so then for perks we're gonna go with ready up so we're gonna be sprinting a lot with the honey badger because it's such a mobile weapon in fact I think it should be an SMG instead of an assault rifle because if you guys look in the creator soldier of uh, the honey badger when you just equip it on your character it's like the smallest assault rifle of them all and looks kind of like an SMG but anyways they grouped it on the under the assault rifle category so that's how it goes I guess so yeah ready up because we're gonna be sprinting a lot and this weapon is very mobile uh, stalker because we're gonna be aiming down sights while uh, and moving a lot and this is gonna help us uh, move faster while aiming down sights so we can win those uh, gunfights where uh, another person is pre-aiming so we have equal footing with them uh, then we have dead silence this class is more of a stealthy class because the inbuilt suppressor and stuff uh, so you basically your idea is to stay stealthy and get the enemies um, without them knowing you're in the area so you need dead silence to keep your footsteps silent so that other people cannot sound hold you and hear your footsteps um, and then we have amplify so that we can hear other people's footsteps and have a tactical edge over them and know when they're coming for us from behind and audio plays an amazing part in call of duty ghost in my opinion so yeah, even if you just plug in to a headset to the back of your TV, you can hear footsteps easily with Amplify. You don't need an Astro, although you can have it if you want. And then we have Focus. Focus is a must perk to have in all of your classes. So if you guys need one perk, just choose Focus because when you're getting shot at, uh, you're going to flinch a lot without Focus. And it, it helps you stay on target when you get shot at and there are many situations in this game where you're getting shot at and you need to stay on target in order to win the gunfight and focus helps you does that, do that. Um, then you have gambler just in case, it, it just a stroke of luck if you um, get an amazing perk like dead eye or off the grid, you're lucky. Then you have uh, the strike package which is a specialist and in my opinion specialist the saw streaks in this game are not that great to be honest with you guys. Um, I like specialist mode and specialist allows you to run and gun more easily with many perks. You can have almost all the perks, in, essential perks in the game not like the stupid perks like on the go because who who runs and reloads guys unless you're a noob. Nobody ever runs and reloads. You always stop the reloads. Why do you need on the go? Anyway I'm sidetracking a bit. So yeah, for specialists we have scavenger because we want to keep using the honey badger continuously. Then we have sleight of hand so we can reload real fast and that really helps in the sticky situations when there are like two guys at you and you're almost out of ammo and you gotta reload real fast. And even with extended clip, the reason I didn't put sleight of hand in my starting perks was because we have extended clip and we don't have to reload that much. Uh, but once we start getting kills and burning the burning through ammo, I think you would need extend uh, slide of hand to reload faster and to potentially save you in those situations. Then you have quick draw and the honey badger zooms in a bit slowly. So in my opinion, quick draw is really essential to zoom in quickly and win those gunfights where you're not pre aiming using stalker. For the burn bonus at 12 kills, we have agility so that the movement speed increases and you want to get from point A to point B real fast in the honey badger because you're probably going to be rushing a lot with this weapon you know, at least I rush a lot with this weapon if you count my gameplay is rushing um, then we have marathon again to have unlimited unlimited sprint so we can outrun our enemies anytime any day um, 
then we have sit traps now guys if you guys don't know ieds are probably the most annoying thing in this game and if you can de detect ieds when you're on a specialist bonus it can potentially uh, potentially save you from uh, dying and denying you the kem the ieds man they're ridiculously overpowered they did nerf them infinity ward but to be honest they didn't do much about them you can jump and avoid them but sometimes they catch you off guard and that is really helpful sit trap Hardline, of course, to achieve your kill streaks one kill before, and when you have the specialist package, you guys obviously you're going for the KEM strike and nothing else. So, yeah, you need a uh, hardline so you can get your KEM at 24 kills. And if you guys didn't know, I got a uh, 24 kill streak. I have it uploaded on my channel, uh, but I forgot to put hardline on my class. So I would have got my KEM, but unfortunately, I didn't put hardline on that class. I did actually get a KEM but I just it's a long story I just don't want to make it tell you guys it's pretty sad because I got my KEM my first ever KEM without recording uh, using the ripper so this is th that's it guys for the video I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay is running out and if you guys did please a li leave a like down below subscribe for more amazing content and I'm out peace